Ah, Prosecutor, I forgot to mention something important. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with them for long. <sighs> It's for your own sake. Uh, I think I, I think I hear the audio thing you were talking about. No. Yeah, it, it, it pops everyone. It's safe to crackles. meet and speak with him. I, I don't know what to do. I understand. Uh, I tried everything in my power to fix it, but I did make it happen less often. All right, I'm pretty sure you heard that. The background audio was scratchy and crackling, whatever you want to call it. That footage was recorded on my PS4 for a let's play that we're doing on my discord servers channel link in description but you're not here for that you're here because your capture cards audio is recording scratchy and crackling and i'm just gonna get straight to the point um this is the standard software that was bundled with my capture card and the first thing i want to say before we get to the fixes is I had to replace the USB-C to USB 3.0 cable that came with the card initially because it was just showing no signal and when it did work it kept blacking out and the audio wasn't there and you know that might be a completely unrelated issue but who knows um, the cable that they package with the card is horrible and I bought a new one on Amazon and I'll leave a link in the description if you're having trouble with that too. Another thing I want to make sure that we're all doing is when you're recording for a specific console make sure the settings are set for that specific console and you can see i'm recording for my switch right now but i have three consoles in a row on my tv stand and i you know i forget to change it like sometimes i'll just swap out the hdmis for my ps4 to my nintendo switch make sure you have it set specifically for like the nintendo switch okay so here are the two fixes i found um the one that everybody goes to is they hold the control key and then go to the settings cogwheel and click that and you'll see there'll be an advanced tab where the settings are this button all you have to do on usb transfer mode is change it from it'll be like a synchronous or automatic i don't know what it is but change it to bulk and then just press OK. And that's literally it. That fixes it. At least for some people. If you're like me, that didn't work. So what I did is, like, I don't know, like every single day I was going back recording audio and it was still coming up scratchy and everything and I didn't know what to do. I had it on bulk. I was doing everything they told me. I was specific input devices, changed my HDMI cables. What I did and what I found is that this little tab thing at the bottom in this quality bar, for some reason, this was set all the way here on the left to good. I, I, I shit you not, all I did was slide it all the way here to best, and the audio was fine. Like, perfect. Everything was perfect. And I've had this for two years, and it's finally working for me. That was a solution. I know that seems like fairly obvious, but for some reason it was all the way back here on good. <laughs> but that that's actually pretty much it. So it's just those two things that you want to look out for. Um, if I helped you at all, let me know in the comments. If I wasted your time, leave a dislike and let me know too. I don't really care. Peace. Okay, I know I just ended the video, but like, I fucking... I, 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 all I did was like, like, I, okay, so I went back to my PS4 and I started recording and, you know, scratching, crackling audio once again. And, but, I mean, you saw it. I had 720p right here. I literally just changed it from fucking HD 720p to HD 1080. And it sounds fine. Listen to that. No scratching, no crackling. Oh my god, I'm so smart.